Welcome back, True Seeker. In the headlines, one day before Super Bowl 55, the death of Leon Spinks, who defeated Muhammad Ali back in 1978. We're just days away from the 43-year anniversary of this fight. But right before Super Bowl 55, this news comes, and if you can believe it, in Jumatria, Leon Spinks equals 55. Recall who died last year right before Super Bowl 54, Kobe Bean Bryant, whose name equaled 54. And, you know, this man defeated the GOAT, Muhammad Ali. Tomorrow, another athlete referred to as the GOAT, Tom Brady, will face Patrick Mahomes. And in light of Leon Spinks dying at age 67, 67 is the 19th prime number. He's from St. Louis, Missouri, who Tom Brady defeated 19 years ago in the Super Bowl, the St. Louis Rams. And tomorrow he faces the Chiefs, who are also from the state of Missouri, Kansas City, Missouri. And with regards to 67 being the 19th prime, don't forget that when Muhammad Ali died, June 3rd, 2016, they gave him a 19-mile funeral procession. And then just weeks after that, in Louisville, Muhammad Ali's hometown, 19-year-old Lamar Jackson at the time became the story of college football. And, of course, Muhammad Ali was Muslim. If you're not familiar with the Quran code, look it up. It's a code that was discovered in 68 about the Quran, and it shows how 19 is the most important number in the Holy Quran. So this man dead at 67, the 19th prime, the news the day before the Super Bowl, Leon Spinks 55, Super Bowl 55, this 19 thing. Again, this stuff is ritual, you guys. Don't forget that blood sacrifice also equals 67. In light of 67 being the 19th prime, Leon is 19. Talking about Leon Spinks. And um, again, he's from St. Louis, Missouri. They're saying he died February 5th. They're putting the news out today, February 6th, but they're saying he died yesterday. 2 slash 5 like 25. Notice Spinks is 25. Death is 25. Leon Spinks 55. The Super Bowl's in Tampa Bay. And um, again, the date of that fight between Ali and Spinks, February 15th, 78. So he died 10 days shy of the anniversary of that fight. It'd be the 43-year anniversary, which means it's been 42 years, 11 months, and days. And, of course, Muhammad Ali has that Chimatria 42, like February, Black History Month, 42, that number stamped all over Black History. From Leon Spinks' last birthday, July 11th, to his death is 209 days later. The Islamic phrase, Alu Akbar, for, you know, God is great or God is the most great. Alu Akbar's got that 209. And in numerology terms, 209 is the equivalent of 29. Muhammad's also got that Jamatria 29. And don't forget, in 2014, I made a video on why we would see Muhammad Ali die at age 74. And sadly, he did. And that's because Muhammad's also 74. It's 74 when you use the alphabetic order. It's 29 when you use the alphabetic order with the rules of numerology. But don't forget, Muhammad Ali died June 3rd, 2016, 6-3, 2016. 2016 is the 63rd triangular number, which means if you had 1 through 63 together, it equals 2016, and he died on 6-3. And they say the prophet Muhammad died at age 63. Again, all this stuff is ritual. Muhammad Ali's death was a ritual. This man's death's a ritual. And this stuff just goes on like clockwork, sports season after sports season. And again, you just got to ask yourself, what are the odds? The night before Super Bowl 55, this is in the headlines, a man from Missouri who's playing in the Super Bowl. Also, if you're interested, if you're not aware, Gematria Effect Sports, the majority of the videos that get posted on this channel, you cannot see because they are exclusives on my Patreon. If you want to go over what we talked about for the Super Bowl, we picked who should win, who should be the MVP, what the likely score will be. Come check out these videos. And yes, they are long, but you can put them on one and a half play speed and get through them a lot faster. And the other thing is, is you don't have to watch the entire videos. I mean, there's a ton of information if you just watch the first 20 minutes of any of these videos. And most of them, you know, it's like an hour of me speaking and then two, three hours of taking calls and other people's observations. And then the other thing is, is there's also written documents that I put out that go with the videos on Patreon. So you can just scan with your own eyeballs the notes and um, tons of information there. 
but you guys can sign up for my Patreon page if you want to check out this information. And tomorrow for the Super Bowl, my community's asked if I'll do a live stream. I'm going to do the live stream if you pledge a dollar. So for all my Patreons, the lowest tier is a dollar. If you pledge a dollar or more, I'll be on there live streaming tomorrow. And, uh, you know, if you don't have anyone to watch the game with because of what's going on, all the COVID stuff, you know, come join us. Today there was over 500 people on the live stream um, for the Super Bowl. And I imagine there'll be quite a few tuning in tomorrow as we just uh, decode the game in real time. So just realize on my live stream, I can't show the game. They'd take it down. So you're going to be in a situation where you want to watch the game on your own screen. But then if you have a listening device nearby, like your cell phone to tune into the Patreon live stream, I'll just be talking about the game in real time. So I'll pin the post for where you can sign up for Patreon. And um, again, this is knowledge that everyone needs to have so they can really see what's going on. It's just, you know, it's not good to be a coincidence theorist. And uh, we explain the same things year after year, the way people are ritually sacrificed. And when you have Jamatra, you can see why they're chosen. Leon Spinks, 55, in the news the day before Super Bowl 55. RIP to this man. And until next time, Truth Seeker.